Hello, in this Bootstrap 4 video we are going to look at nesting media objects. So we've got our media object right here that we've done previously. I'll just show you what that looks like. It's like a blog comment. But what you can do is add media objects within media objects and that's if you use the example of a blog and commenting, it's sort of simulating somebody responding to a comment and then somebody responding to that comment so forth so forth so to do is really simple I'm not gonna like write any code out because we got the media object right here it's gonna copy this obviously if you want it to be different you'll have to do another media object but in terms of structure I'm just gonna copy that and to embed a media object into this one all you do is go to the media body go to the media heading after that is the bit of text that is displayed right here aka the content the body uh, the text body I should say the meat of the con media object and after that you simply copy and paste your new media object and now I'm just going to sort out the indentation save that refresh and there we go we've got a media object inside a media object and you can add as many media objects within each other as, as you want so I'm just going to add it again same principle just add it after this text right here it's going to sort out the indentation save it refresh there we go we got this media object that is embedded into this one this is nested into this one and you might be thinking okay how do I add a media object so it's nested in here but it's displayed after this one so it's like chronologically speaking it was added let's say to a database after both of these but you don't want it nested within this one or within that one you want it in the same line and to do that all you do is add it after this media object not inside but after so what I'm gonna do is go here this is the core text this is the first nested media object. I just need to find the closing div. It's just underlined this. So let's scroll down. It's right here. So I'm just going to add it after that. Sort out the indentation again. Save it. Go back, refresh, and there we go. We got a media object that is indent. I mean, in nested into this media object, and it's in line with this one. So it's already looking like less. Like I said, a commentary system, a blog or some sort of news article with very little effort. So that's nested media objects. If you have any questions, feel free to post them on sonarlearning.co.uk for slash question.php. There's thousands of completely free tutorials on their video tutorials, that is. Please rate, comment and subscribe as it does really help keep the content free. Plus also we'll have a link in the description to the source code from this video. So if you're having a bit of trouble, check that out and as usual thank you for watching and i hope you have a great day